The Arabian Gulf University AGU was awarded certificates of the university's distance learning department programs by the American Association for Educational Communications and Technology, AECT. AGU President Dr. Khalid Al-Ohali said in a statement that AGU is the first university outside the United States to have its academic programs fully accepted, ratified and revised by AECT. Dr. Al-Ohali also confirmed that, that the ratification is the result of an agreement signed earlier between AGU and AECT, which is one of the most uh, reputed professional associations and specialized organizations in educational technologies and its application in the educational process on an international level. Here at the Arabian Gulf University, Gulf Cooperation Council that addresses six different countries in the region, accreditation and quality of education is the main priority, especially that our university and our the College of Graduate Study offers programs that are leading program and very specialized in whether in the education field or in the technology fields. So today, our Department of Distance Learning have succeeded to be accredited by the American Association of Instructional Design and uh, Workforce Development. This accreditation is actually a milestone toward excellence in the field. This is a wonderful day at AGU. Uh, today we're recognizing the distance learning program and uh, this is a big deal because this is the first international program that AECT has recognized. And AECT is our Association for Educational Communications and Technology. It's the leading organization in educational technology to recognize how to improve teaching and learning. So today we're recognizing the distance ed program. I think the main thing I would say about the AGU distance program is having we had a team that reviewed all the courses and the curriculum and we found that it's a very good quality. There were no major gaps or missing information that we were, we were glad to see. And so um, overall we're very pleased with what AGU has presented today.